Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel Hybrid Plus. In this tutorial series I will introduce you to the frameworks of SDL2 and SDL2 image. And as we progress with the entire series you will learn step by step how to set up a window, how to load images and then also how to uh, determine the RGB information of a pixel and so on. So. In this video, we'll start with setting up the SDR2 framework in your Xcode project. So to start with, open Xcode, then create a new project. Go to macOS and then click on command line 2 and click next. Here you can give your project any name you want. I'm going to call it SDL test. Choose C++ as the language and click next. Create. Now, we next want to download the required libraries for the project. So to do that, we're going to visit two websites. I will share the link to the websites in the description. And here you want to scroll down to development libraries. You want to download the macOS version of it. And you do the same thing for the SDL2 image framework. Go to development libraries and then pick Mac OS X. Download the framework. Now open both frameworks. And after that, you want to drag the frameworks onto your desktop. Now, after you've downloaded them successfully, you want to go to computer, click on Macintosh, go to library, and then go to frameworks. Now select both of them and put them into the folder. Authenticate. Good. Now the frameworks are in the folder where they are supposed to be. You can return to your Xcode project we just created. And here you want to go to build settings. Now in build settings, you want to go to search path, which is here, search path. And here you want to um, copy paste the framework search path and the header search path. So I just closed it. Let me open the folder again. You go to Macintosh, library, and then to frameworks. And here you want to pick any of the two. Click on right click on them, information, and then copy paste the path to the framework, which you're going to paste into here. You click double click it plus and then paste. So this is it for the framework path. And for the header path, you want to click on the framework, have it display the headers folder, right click on it and copy the place where it is. This one you're going to add to the header search path. And don't forget to add headers at the end so that it actually looks inside the folder. You do the same thing for the SDR2 framework. Just add it underneath and also don't forget to add headers at the end like this. Now after you've done that you can include both of the libraries which are essential to the frameworks we just downloaded. Just include them up here. And you will notice that there isn't any error message from Xcode. So it means that we've done, um, we've included the libraries and the frameworks correctly so far. But we have to, in addition to that, also um, add the frameworks into this section, which is called linked frameworks and libraries. 
So you have to additionally go here, click on plus, add other, and then you're gonna go to Macintosh, go to library, uh, go to frameworks and select the two frameworks we just implemented into the project. Frameworks, and which one was it? Like this. And you also want to check if it is in build phase in this section, because ha it has to be on both. And now you can test the project by just running it. And as you can see, the build has succeeded, so there was no difficulty or problem in locating the libraries and the frameworks, and it has been successfully integrated in the project. From here on now, from here on onwards, we're gonna go and do some really amazing things with the libraries we just included. So stay tuned, and you're gonna enjoy the rest. So thank you for watching.